tea fittings are a special case where the flow rate through the tea will be different for each flow path and therefore two fittings should be used. One fitting on each flow path is used to model the pressure loss for the tea. The correct flow rates along the various paths will be applied to the appropriate through tea or branch tea fitting coefficients when calculating the fitting pressure losses. For the purposes of this demonstration, pipe entrance fittings from tanks have been omitted for clarity. When we are dealing with unequal pipe sizes, where the pipe sizes that connect to the T are not equal, the T fitting sizes used should match to the nominal pipe sizes. Model 1 shows a diverting T, where there is one branch line. The through T fitting is added to pipe 2 and the branch T fitting is added to pipe 3. In a diverting T, it is important to add the fittings to the pipes after the branching node because the friction loss needs to be calculated from the velocity of the fluid in each pipe into which the fluid flow has been separated and not that of the pipe carrying the total pre-diverted flow. Model 2 shows a converging T with two branch lines. A branch T fitting has been added to pipe 4 and a branch T fitting has also been added to pipe 5. In a converging T, we need to add the T fittings to the pipes before the joining node so that the friction losses are calculated from the fluid velocities in the individual pipes that are joining at the node. Model 3 shows a diverting T with two branch lines. A branch T fitting has been added to pipe 8 and a branch T fitting has also been added to pipe 9. And finally, Model 4 shows a converging T where there is one branch line. A through T fitting has been added to pipe 10 and a branch T fitting has been added to pipe 11.